Hey guys, this is What If here. Today we're doing another commentary. Uh, yet again, I'm literally doing this race right after Texas that I magically got nine. So time to do Kansas. Now this Kansas, uh, Kansas, god damn, I can't talk. It's, look at the home dash. It's 1.37 in the fucking morning. I am tired. I'm sure by the time you're watching this, you're like, my god, What If, you've been like, Doing all this in one night? Well, gee, you have no life then. You're a loser. <laughs> but, um, I, I was just, I'm, I'm just having way too much fun doing these races. I mean, like, definitely commentating over these is a lot more fun. It's definitely giving me the motivation to actually do these races and everything. I should probably should have done this a very long time ago. Actually, sure uh, just like this week in Nork, depending on yeah, when I upload this, uh, they, Nork, is the Nork League is going to Kansas for the third race in the chase, I believe. Fourth race in the chase, yeah, fourth race. And I am doing terrible in the chase so far. Um, God like, I think I got in fifth at Chicagoland, ninth at Martinsville, or ninth at New Hampshire, eighth, I don't remember. And I got sixth at Dover, so I'm not really doing too amazing. Cause there are people like DG and Freddie and Jade. Well, J Day isn't in the chase, but there's those two and routers. I believe Revan as well have been doing much, much better in the chase than I have. It's really kind of questioned my abilities in Nork at this point. I thought about doing uh, amateur, but well, kind of got told no by Revan. If I, you know, can't really do it. I mean, I'm I'm in the chase, so the rules kind of say I can't really do it. So, I mean, that's alright. And I'm, wow, I kept doing fucking terrible. I did not go through that corner at all good whatsoever. That was probably the worst entry I have done in my racing career. I'm, wow, I'm not going to do these corners at all. I'm going to have an absolutely god awful lap time. Yeah, this is going to be pitiful. Jesus Christ, 30 seconds. I will at least want to get like a 28th or something. Wow, my car is not rotating. It did not even attempt. <laughs> it did not even attempt to st uh, rotate through that corner. It just refused to turn there. This corner. Yeah, it's just it's just not turning. I'm literally turning into the corner the same as I've always have been. It, it, it's just not turning. This is going to be one of those races where okay, it's going to be a fucking nightmare. You can feel it. That was fucking bad. That was absolutely terrible. Maybe because I'm playing at 1.30 in the morning, but Jesus Christ, that was something else. Just kind of praying that maybe I can get another top 10 out of my ass like last race. And... But no, I doubt that'll happen. Speaking about Kansas, this race goes by fast. This is a really quick race on the wise 13 laps for this, but eh. Why am I complaining? I like short races, anyways. But yeah, this is not going to be fun. Speaking about the Nork, I was talking because we're Raven's playing and doing the amateur series, and I was thinking about doing it because I'm really happy to be doing well, so I kind of thought I can go down there. But kind of felt bad because I, ooh, shit, I know deep down I was wanting to do that maybe so I can win more, do better, and some, that's something I don't want to do. I don't want to if I don't. Oh, damn, if I don't necessarily have to, you know, go down to a lower series so I can win, I don't want to do that. Definitely something I learned. And everything, I don't really... Definitely one of the decisions I thought at the time was alright, but it really wasn't. And this is the only part of the track they slow up a little bit down, so I go way down here, so they know they break up a little bit, because, you know, you don't really gain that much going through there. I know some of the AI do get a little bit out of control going in this corner, like they go in the corner and just like turn right, they like slide all the way up the track. I know that's how some wrecks are caused, depending on the Why am I gaining so much spots all of a sudden? Oh, see that right there? Man, just what I was talking about, the major, major pileup. If the damage was on, that whole backfield, including my car, would be fucked. See, like, watch, he's going in the corner, going in the corner he just he turns right and just wrecks Hornish and Rex Stenhouse and got into me and the whole field piles in a full throttle Arca everybody's Arca Arca in it and another that card is glitched <laughs> Jesus Christ my god 
<laughs> I'm in the 18th. <laughs> All right. They, it's like I, I I keep saying I'm terrible at these tracks, but uh, the AI just wrecks for me, so I can have another chance to you know catch up and wow. I am I am amazed that that just happened. I have I really have no other words to describe what the hell just happened there. Ah, uh, damn, we're out of room. Why is Hornish up here? I mean, he pretty much got dumped. Um, I'm really confused. Turn, car, turn. I don't want to hit Mark. Marky Mark, out, Ricky. Alright, I don't know what I'm trying to accomplish running out here. Oh, oh, Hornish, you bastard. Wow. <laughs> I guess he heard me. Yo, okay, turn. Keep going, baby. Keep going. Oh, I might really get a top ten. Well, I might have gotten it. Maybe would have had a top ten if Hornish didn't run into me like a. You know. <laughs> That's against the rules, Hornish. Used to be an indie car. You know, you know, you can't block an indie car. <laughs> you do. The only reason why I do that voice is because I'm like I'm kind of like either doing a terrible joke or some stupid crap. I'm really, really scared to be on the outside because I don't trust the AI drivers. You know, turning right and you know going right into me. Ooh. All right, all right, get a run. 15th, 14th, 13th, 12th. Ooh, Junior, that's kind of, uh, uh, kind of, uh, extreme for you. Usually you're not really the driver to go crazy and make a move like that, but, oh well. Yeah, my car is just not rotating. I really, ooh, damn, Kurt. Fucking fidgeted and clipped the wall, bounced into him. Dalton ran to Edwards now. Ow, okay, I'm very, very scared right now. Please don't turn into me. Yeah, I'm, it doesn't look like I'm going to get a top 10. I thought I was, but then kind of Hornish just, you know, kind of just, you know, basically just ran into me, you know. I, mean, I don't really think I moved my line at all, he just plowed right through me. Yeah, this is this just seems like where I'm gonna stall out unless the AIs can wreck themselves again for me so I can get a top ten. Ow. Kind of amazed how aggressive the AI have been, at least in this race. Some tracks like they're really aggressive. Like Auto Club they're aggressive. Here they're really aggressive as well. Martinsville they are too going into the corners, like they don't they don't they have no mercy. Yeah, this might be where I might. This might be where I'm gonna stall out here. I don't think I'm gonna do much better. I must say these fucking races have been really, really insane. Yeah, I just can't. I can't rotate the car enough. Oh wow! Thank you. <laughs> I was just kind of saying that. <laughs> of course, it'll be Danica. What are you doing, Danica? What are you? <laughs> What are you doing, Danica? Go home, you're drunk. What was that? What did she wreck? Who did she hit? She, like, wrecked herself. Like, she was on the, in the grass and just came up the track and just spun out. It, you know, if that was, like, some back-of-the-pack driver, like, um, Eric Amarola. Not Eric Amarola, like, Michael McDowell or something. But it, the fact it's Danica just makes the situation 50 times funnier. Just... It's, it's just common fact. One on the bottom. I'm really. S I don't know how. I, don't, I might get a top ten if I, you know, if I'm lucky enough. Just don't hit any drivers, and no drivers run into me. I will be in good shape. Whoa, man! They really, really slowed down through that corner. Oh, Stuart really stopped. Holy, my God, that was just insane. If I didn't, if I was like a second, half a second off, I would have been so screwed. And Hornish is right behind me, too. Great. I don't care if it was anybody but him. Go, car, go. Basically, just put the block on him. 
Alright, I'm in 10th. I am i don't know how I'm pulling this off. Just try to hug that bottom line so Hornish can't get the advantage. If the AI wrecked themselves this time, like right in front of me, I'm going to be like pretty moderately upset. I don't know how I'm in 10th. It's just basically because the AI has been wrecking themselves so I can get past a couple cars and stall out in position and just hold them off. I I must admit this is really, I did not expect this kind of racing to happen. Like really, I did not. Ooh, I'm really close to the wall. I did not expect all this shit to happen. Usually when I do these season mode races, they're normally really calm, but this is fucking, this is insane. God damn. Check the results, see where Junior is. I know I've passed. Oh no, I didn't. He got seven, so he'll gain a couple points on me, but still. My god, this has been insane. Alright, let's check the points to see where this where he stands up. I can't. Jesus Christ. Alright, let's see where it stands up. I am leading the points, 10 points over Junior now. Uh, Tony starts in third. Nothing too much is shaked out except for Brack is also gaining a spot. Shrex losing one. Johnson stay where he is. Mark Marn gained another spot. He is now two points behind Biffle into the chase. That's, you know, insane. And Logano's 18th. McMurray dropped back to 17th. He's reached look good. Uh, McMurray's really tanking. He, at one point, he was ninth in the standing. That's kind of cool that for him. Alright, Burden stayed back in 15th. I am amazed how crazy this racing has been this season. Next race is Richmond. Um, not yet again. I'm not really good there, but somehow I've been pulling miracles out of my ass. So maybe this will be the race again that I might not do well, but I don't know. This race, all these races have been just amazing. That I haven't been, you know, doing as bad as I thought because you know they have been wrecking themselves so much. But thank you for watching. I am still speechless on what the hell just happened. I can't believe that just happened. It's been an insane race, a couple of races. I can't wait to do Richmond and see how that turns out. Thank you for watching. I'll see you later and I'll see you at Richmond. I am going to bed right now because it's almost 2 in the morning. I am freaking tired. <laughs> Alright, thank you for watching. I'll see you later and have a nice day. It's what If Racing signing out.